Hey guys, how's it going? It's Jay from Sony Alpha Lab, and what I got in this video is a vlogging test using the Sony ZV-1 and the shooting grip that Sony came out with as well. So I'm gonna go for a hike with the kids in this video and I'm just using the camera basically out of the box. I didn't really manipulate any settings. All I did was set the video quality to 4K and that's pretty much it. So all the settings are at default and I wanted to illustrate to you what this camera could do in the real world straight out of the box. If you pretty much know nothing about photography and video, you're just basically pointing and shooting. That's what I did in this vlogging test. This is not a review of the ZV-1, it's just a vlogging test in this video, okay? The full review is coming soon, so stay tuned for that. And I'm also gonna do some tutorials and you know a beginner's guide for the ZV-1 as well. Be sure to subscribe if you wanna see those videos coming in the near future. But for now, just check out this sample video footage from a little hike that I went on with the kids, and I will wrap it up at the end and give you my thoughts on how the ZV-1 performed in this fairly quick vlogging test, real world style. All right, I'll catch up with you in a minute. They're gonna get crushed in the bag, no? No, just put them on top. Put them on top? Just put them on top of all the snacks and then put them in a little baggie. All right. Thank you. I think you should seriously cut them up. Cut them up, huh? Because you're gonna get crumbled anyway. All right, so we're gonna go on a quick hiking adventure. So I figured I would take, take this opportunity to do a quick vlog here. I got the kids in the car. Hello. There's Layla. Jay, say hi. There's hi. There's <laughs> All right, guys, let's go. Where can we get the sharp turn? Woo! Why do you hate being recorded, Jace? I don't see the problem. Because I don't like being seen by everyone in the world. <laughs> she can speak slightly. What about you, Layla? I don't really mind. It's the really world. Unique area. I guess we're there. We're gonna walk somewhere down that way. See where we end up. We are officially on the trail. Whoa. It's a little bit rocky. It's not rocky. Cool leaves. A lock on AF works really yourself? good. I almost want to crush them. No crush the mushrooms. Where they do look cool though, right? Yeah, they look fluffy. Chase, come here, buddy. You gotta carry the leaf bag. No way, you're recording me. Carry the leaf bag, come on. Don't you're be... recording! No, just don't be lazy. <laughs> Listen, somebody's gotta carry the leaf bag. Chase, come on, man. If you wanna be the coolest, you gotta carry the leaf bag. I'm already the coolest. You're already the coolest. You don't wanna be the hero and carry the leaf bag? <laughs> Some pretty scenes here in the woods, that's for sure. Layla, careful, buddy. Okay. Daddy. All right, so we have a decision to make. Either we walk through to the right, which looks like an awesome tunnel in like a pine forest, or we go left, which looks more like what we're currently walking on. Wait. I hear water to the left. Jace, do you want to carry the leaf bag yet? Nope. <laughs> Come on. A cartwheel on the log? I feel confident enough that I could, but I'm not going. I don't, would, definitely would not try that. Exactly, that's why I'm not. Stay still. Let's get So, the long way or the short way is the question. Jace, what's your vote? Long way or short way? Short way. Short? Yes. Layla? Long, because always when you go the long way, it's always something that looks cooler. All right, I kind of have to agree with Layla. We'll come back to short way, Jace. Thank you. Looks like we're on the red trail now. Huh. Red usually means harder, right? All right, well, we're definitely making some progress on our hike. It looks like we got about a mile and a half left. And uh, so far, this... Sony ZV-1 seems to be working 
pretty darn good. I don't know how the audio sounds. We'll find out when I get back home. Let me know in the comments below. All right, so I stand corrected. The muffins are in pristine shape. Layla was 100% correct. Look at those things. Wow. <laughs> what? You ready to carry the leaf bag yet? No? Do you want to add that to the leaf bag? This? If yeah. you want to add stuff to the leaf bag, you got to carry the leaf bag. <laughs> so well, you just be... added them, you have to carry the leaf bag. <laughs> oh, good point. Here, Layla. Oh, you've been bested by Jason again. This kid is too smart. You out of breath? I'm about to die. You're about to die? This is a tunnel section. Check this out. Looks like a tunnel. It's just a little hill. You can do it. Come on, buddy. Look, I'm breathing heavy too. Come on. You just gotta walk, dude. Don't run. Just walk. Layla's leading the way. It reminds me of Jumanji. Jumanji? Cool leaf, Layla. Thank you. <laughs> Daddy, we have to go. Layla's like getting far ahead. Whoa, look at this cool bridge. Huh? Trail marker. Trail marker. It's, water. it's letting you know that you're on the right trail. Like, we gotta keep going this way. Red trail. All right, be careful. Looks like the railing's broke. Oh my gosh, look at that. Ooh, a tree fell on it. Wow, this is cool. All right, where's the red marker? We right go, there. We going the right way? Yep. Very right good. There. All right, lead the way, Jace. Just gotta let your brother lead for a little while, Layla. <laughs> You're a great leader, don't get me wrong. What do we got? Okay. Interesting. What's mm. that thing called? Ch uh, <laughs> what the heck is it called again? Acorn. Acorn. That's what it's called. Egg, not acorn. 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 Well, I feel really stupid. All right, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Um, imagine that we just walk on this trail the next time, and you go farther, and then the trail just goes straight down. Straight down. Straight down to where? Straight down. To the center of the earth. Yup. <laughs> yup. Well, it's right here, right in front of me. There's a spider web. It's really hard to see, but it's definitely there. Whoa, dude, you look like a superhero going over that thing. Is that because of the Spider-Man shirt? <laughs> no comment? <laughs> he hates being filmed. I'm here in water. We are getting close. Pretty cool waterfall. Check this out. Let's zoom in here. Nice. What did you think of the waterfall, Layla? I thought it was really cool. Was it worth the walk? Definitely. Yeah? yeah. Jace, was the waterfall worth the walk? A little bit. A little bit. So we have mixed reviews about the waterfall. Layla says it was totally worth it. Jace says a little bit. I'd say it was definitely worth it. All right, so after going over the footage in detail, I was wondering how good the audio would be in particular and also how the camera performed going out there and letting it do its own thing basically out of the box. And it worked really well. Uh, one thing I did notice, I'm actually very impressed with how good the audio quality is, but when you're behind the camera, the, the actual microphones are facing forward. So when you're behind the camera talking, you know, if you're like interviewing somebody or something, like I was talking to the kids and stuff, you can tell that it's like a little muffled when recording from the back, but when you're in front of the camera, it sounds quite good, in my opinion. I was actually very happy with the audio quality, and obviously a, a, a higher quality professional mic would be a better option, but you don't really need one, in my opinion. The, the, the audio quality sounds pretty darn good, 
just straight off the camera. I was, I was actually very impressed with that. One thing I did notice was the white balance does tend to shift around. In several clips, the footage looks like too green, like the white balance was shifting all over the place. I had it set to auto white balance, that's what it was on by default. But you really do want to hard set your white balance if you're recording video to whatever environment you're in because the white balance will float around if you go into the shade for example the colors will shift and it doesn't really look that good so i noticed when i was watching the footage how the white balance was shifting around one way and then the other and um, that doesn't really give the best professional look so you definitely want to make sure you hard set your white balance other than that the camera so by default was set up really well one other thing i did notice actually was the flip out screen to the side when i was talking to the camera i was looking at the screen to the right of the camera and i was not looking at the actual lens like i'm looking now i was looking away like see how i'm like not looking at the lens right now I had that I noticed when I was looking at the ZV1 in that one sequence where I was actually talking to the camera, I was looking at the screen and not the lens and that really didn't look that good. So that's another thing you need to keep in mind when doing vlogs and looking at that side camera. Just use it for reference, you know, to make sure your framing is okay, but when you're actually talking to the camera, make sure you're looking at the lens itself. So that was just another thing, but the full review for this camera is coming soon, so please stay tuned for that. This is obviously not a review. This was just a quick vlogging test. I'm going to do a beginner's guide for this camera to show you how to set it up as a beginner, and then I'm going to give you some tips as well upcoming in the in the future and i'll also be doing a full review as as well so stay tuned for that please be sure to hit that subscribe button and the notification bell if you want to be informed when i come out with more videos on the sony zv1 in the near future all right guys i will catch up with you next time take care have a good day